What on earth is a corpus? A corpus is a massive bunch of text that has been collected for research purposes. One of the best and biggest corpora is absolutely free. It was created by a researcher at Brigham Young University. The easiest way to get to it is to type BYU corpus into your search bar. Here it is, the first link. The corpus we want is the Corpus of Historical American English, which linguists in the know call COA. When you get inside, the screen looks a little intimidating, but don't panic. You don't need to know how to use all of these features unless you really want to. I'll show you just what you need to do for our class. The first thing you should do is register. Registration is free, it helps COA continue its funding, and it keeps you from getting locked out after a few searches. So you would click the registration link here. I'm already registered, so I will log in. Once you're logged in, look at the options in your left column. Under Display, the List button should already be selected. If it isn't, select it now. Under Sections, the Show box should already be checked. If it isn't, check it now. Next, type your search term into the box. I'm going to type Impact. The results automatically expand to let you see more of them, but if you move your mouse back to the left, it shrinks back down. Now you can see in the results that IMPACT has been used more than 8,000 times in the total corpus, and that the uses have been increasing through the decades. But what exactly are those uses? Well, if you click any of these numbers, the panel at the bottom will show you a snippet of text so that you can judge the context. You have the year of publication, the type of text, fiction, nonfiction, magazine. You can see the name of the publication, and all of these items are linked to further information. If you run into trouble, or if you want to know more about the really remarkable things that COA and all the other corpora can do, there's help all over the place. These question marks will give you context specific help, or from the main screen, this Where to Start link will also give you a lot of great information.